Now, I, because I've caught so many fish, I tried going to a small crankbait and it seemed to work. Look it, isn't that a big mouth to just engulf fish? Just gonna gently let him go. He's probably gonna take off pretty quick. There he goes. Now, this is called a smash shad. You know what, that pike did smash it. It's only about four inches long, right from the tip of the tail to the actual lip, but it has a really nice natural action and you can control it and fish it slow if you want and even twitch it. So what I've got is, I've got it rigged up to a bait caster and uh, I was just cranking it very lightly, very slowly and giving it little twitches. The nice part about the Pelican is that it comes equipped with rod holders that are built in right into the kayak, but also it has the, the tracks so that you can put the different types of Scotty rod holders on it. So you can see this is one style of rod holder. I have another one right here for both bait casters and spinning outfits. So there's no problem putting your rods out of the way. And I even have a little device at the front here. Look, this thing that looks like a V, almost like a slingshot. That's where I can actually put my rod. If I put my rod down, look, I can actually put it in there if I've got a fish on and it's not gonna slide out of the boat. So it's almost like when you use a stick when you're still fishing from shore to put your stick on or your, fish, your fishing rod on. So all these attachments really help to the enjoyment when you're out here fishing. But that crankbait produced, I was surprised that that fish just smashed it.